What's up, everybody? Mr. and Mrs. Mickey Joe back at you, you guys. Hello. I hope everybody's doing good out there. Yes. Some scary shit going on. Mm, not happy times. Not happy times. Let's, let's bring it up. Let's bring it up. We got a zombie rash tonight, you guys. Uh, this is from allmres.com, and check it out. This right here is the Fire It Up specialty menu. Um, classic Mickey Joe. I don't remember what came in this. Uh, it's that been a minute is. since I've ordered it. Let's open it up. I do know that it has two mains. So that all right. oh, what? There you go. Nice, nice. This is these come in nice bags. You could use these bags for water or to store your pee or poop or whatever you want. Oh, whoops. Yep. Forgot the garbage bag. <laughs> So, let's see, what are we, we have got a beef snack. Nice, that was my nickname in high school. I don't know if you knew that, but it was. Beef snack. Um, Call me old beefy. Okay. <laughs> nice, this, uh, it's probably going to be, I don't, I don't know if it feels double wrapped. Usually, this will just be a little piece of jerky. Um, they're usually double wrapped, so. Beef snack, noise. Got some tortillas. Hey. Some, tor some chipotle. The chipotle. Chipotle, I believe is how it's pronounced. Chipotle. Of course. Makes total sense. Now those, of course, are the chipotle tortillas. I've only had those once, I think. All right. We've got some body parts candies. Well, that comes... It's the zombie ration, of guys. Course, you know you what know, I mean? I was... It comes with, like... A lot of them come with brains and shit. I think that's an ear... Pretty sure that's an yeah. ear. All right, so we got some ear candy, needs, which is actually a record store here in town. Ear candy. <laughs> <laughs> that's a joke that only we get. All right, we've got one of these nice... Uh, nice old big flameless ration heater. Yeah. We haven't been using our FRHs lately. I'm sure you've noticed. Uh, I don't know, that's just a personal choice. I think it's easier to just put a pot of water on and, and boil it. And uh, I'm getting a nice little stash of these going on. Yeah, I got your little hand wipe there. Nice. The Sunset brand. Which, of course, is good, I guess. Maybe. This thing, which we don't need. Bye. Ooh, some cheese spread with some jalapenos. Boom, 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 boom. Cheese spread with jalapenos. One of my favorite things. That's going to go well with those uh, Chipotle tortillas, I think. Some Taster's Choice. Nice. Nescafe. That's just the coffee. That's not like, that's that's not a three-in-one or anything. Crushed red peppers. That's going to be really weird in the coffee, I think. But whatever. <laughs> I mean, it's obvious what they want us to do. I don't know. Maybe it was this thing. Ooh. The chocolate hazelnut cocoa. Mmm. Mm. Chocolate hazelnut cocoa. It's not really what I want with spicy, fire it up type food, but hey, man, I, it's been a minute since I've had, uh, I think I've had that a couple times, maybe in an MCW. All right, so we got some uh, chili and macaroni. Okay, see, now that's the one thing that I remembered came in here is the chili mac. I knew this had chili mac in it. It's pretty cool. That's the chili mac. There you go. Nice little, that's, that's a solid little retort pouch. All right, chili mac. All right, and then we've got a spicy pound cake. Ooh, nice. That's mm -hmm. actually not like spicy, well, but I that's, know that. Yeah, I was telling I was telling these guys. I see. Not you, honey. I thought you were just giving me crap because of the way that I kind of pronounced it there. I don't think so. All right, we've got a chicken creole with rice. Oh, with brown rice even. Mm -hmm. Okay, chicken creole. All right, so we got two mains in here, you guys. I was correct in my uh, rememberings. Yes, I was correct. All right. Nice. So, looky there. Both of us actually get one. Sweet. It's a double sunset, you guys. <laughs> Do you get it? Oh, goodness. All right, a nice bag of utensils there, fork, That's spoon, knife. Salt and pepper and a napkin. That's yep. what we in the biz call a cutlery kit. Ooh, and then we've got some... Okay. 
Tabasco. Okay. Some green sauce and some chipotle. Okay, guys. Confession time. This is why I bought this ration. I've never seen many bottles of the green or the chipotle. I don't think we're going to open these. And in fact, I don't think the green one would be good on any of this stuff. The green one I like on eggs. Let me know in the comments what you like it on, which is your favorite Tabasco. I actually don't really like the regular stuff, but maybe we'll pop that one open because it's not super skunky like the last bottle of Tabasco yeah, that actually, we pulled out of a ration. You know, this the, is the correct color. This is, yeah, all this stuff is new. Like this, One of the things I love about the zombie ration, guys, is the... Uh, the actual bottles, the little mini bottles of Tabasco, because these are sort of like a, an old school MRE thing. Um, as long as they've been MREs, I think, you know. Uh, anyway, um, yeah, look at all of that. The fired up menu, you guys. Um, looks very nice. Looks nice. We're going to heat it up and be right back. All right, you guys, we got it out onto a train. It's all hot and ready to go. Um, there's a lot of this. This is very busy and it's bothering me. So let's. I'm gonna go ahead and open this beef snack. That was made. If it's standard uh, ration dating code, that was the 338th day of 2017. Which isn't super fresh, but you know what I mean. It's fucking fine. It's jerky. God damn it. Sorry, tripod Tony. It was double wrapped and it is the Bulls brand. So this is usually what you'll find in a standard United States, uh, you know, like the uh, government-issued MREs, the Bulls brand. I like that. It's good. I'm excited about the Chipotle tortillas and the old jalapeno cheese spread here. This I wasn't needing during the break like I usually am. It's all right. All right. Got the coffee started here. Oh, yeah, you got the coffee. Okay, so the coffee did not come with cream and sugar. This did not come with cream and sugar, nor did it come with a cold drink, which is kind of a bummer. That is very, uh... Like Coarse grounds. Chunky. Coarse chunky, grounds chunky. Is, is, is what you call that. All right. I'll hook you up here. All right. Coarse grounds. Yeah, I got water, blah, blah, blah. So yeah, this didn't come with cream and sugar, and I was like, Mrs. Mickey Joe, do you want to just like roll with this, like uh, just black coffee? And she was like, that sounds all right. And I was like, actually, I want cream and sugar. So what I did was I went and got into my little uh, drank stash, and I got some uh, cream, some U.S. issued cream, and I got some uh, Lithuanian sugar. How I, about that? I justified it. I said, you know. Kukras. You might have some extra from a past ration or something. I do. I, I have a couple. So, you know. Got, got a couple extra. Nothing that any other military gentleman might not do. Yeah, I mean, like, maybe some other dude's already got one of these in his back pocket because he's had a bunch of them and, you know, like, he didn't have the coffee one time or whatever. And then maybe you just happen to have some fucking Lithuanian sugar laying around. As, as we all do. You know what I mean? As we all do. Word. All right, so I guess let's try this. All right, I got this here, uh, hazelnut cocoa beverage. The hazelnut cocoa beverage. All right, got my Dunder Mifflin World's Best Box mug. Let's see if I can get this at the fill. I'll tell you, that's not half bad for just a cup of black coffee. Just instant black coffee. I'm still going to put all the stuff in it, but, uh, that's, that's better than a lot of the things you'll find in a, uh, Hermetically yeah. sealed ration. Nah? Not You're not bad. into it? No, I mean, it's not. It's it's not bad. We're falling all over each other here, guys. It's been the same for 20 years. Right. Oh, my God. Come on. But, um, that wasn't a joke. It's true. I love this woman, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube. He's, I do. He's so nice. I love her. I don't know why. Why I'm nice? No. I don't know. Why? It's, it's in why genetically you love me encoded, still. I suppose. Oh. How it is that you still love me after all this? Oh time. my god. Get over yourself. You're friggin' hot, first off. You're hot. I got and like yourself you... absolutely. Dude, crazy. she's hot, you guys. No. I love Mrs. Mickey Joe. This stuff is actually very hot now that yeah. I'm starting to shake it oh, around. Oh yeah, that's that's a fun shake right there. All right, I forgot to put the sugar in when I put the cream in. 
We're really rolling it. Yeah, this is going terribly. Why do you guys keep watching? <laughs> Holy shit, and I'm so not even positive. kidding. I'm not kidding. My views are spiking right now. Like, they're doing that thing they do every few months where, like, some older videos get pushed on somebody else's channel. And all of a sudden, like, I'm spiking. No, that's not centered very well. Okay, there we go. Okay, I'm gonna... This one is the Chili Mac, and that one is the Creole. The labels came off in the uh, hot water, but we know okay. which one is which. I think that has been shaken yeah, you've, sufficiently. You've jiggled the bag nicely, my, my dear. She's an expert bag jiggler, y'all. <laughs> They're a good bag lady. <laughs> All right, Chili Mac. Fuck yeah. We're going to have us some Chili Mac tonight. Now, we were talking about this the other night, and I didn't go back through the videos and look or anything because I'm not like that. Um, but we're pretty sure Mrs. Mickey Joe had the Chili Mac as a uh, freeze-dried uh, entree in, the, in an MCW. All right, so, yeah, we got this all shaken up go. and... That does not look like much. It doesn't appear to be a lot of stuff. No. All right, so this is the chicken creole with the brown rice. Mm. However, it is tasty. Yeah? Yes. Ooh, this package is hot. Ouch. The other one didn't get me like this. All right, chicken creole with mm. brown rice, you guys. Look at that. Oh, yes. That's good stuff. I'm going to get into it. Mmm, oh my god. That is very good. That's very good. Alrighty. Yum, yum. Why don't you go ahead and open that cake? Alright. And we'll have it all open. I'm gonna do the torts. The Chipotle torts, y'all. Alright. These, let me just look just for shits and giggles. We're looking at the 172nd day of 2018. So, what is this? The 248th day of... 2018? That is exactly what it is, you guys. Ah, I did it. Yep. She's reading the, the date codes right. Look at that. Chipotle tortillas. They look kind of waxy on camera, but they really... Mm. They're a little shiny. They're not bad. Look at those. Yeah. Ooh, they smell good. Yes. It's got that cheese as does, spread. As, as does the spice cake. Yes. Very... Nice. Very nice looking here. Let's, let's get into this. Feels We're excited good. about all of this. This sounds good. You guys, how are you doing? Who out there is uh, under shelter-in-place sort of restrictions right now? Anybody? That sucks if you are. Is my head in the camera? I'm sorry if it was. Look at this. Look at this. We all need a smile in these crazy times, you guys. Jalapeno cheese spread on a Chipotle tortilla. We're gonna we're gonna yeah. smush that around a little bit in there. Just gonna have us some quesadillas. I might put some chili mac in the next one. I, I did save some of this stuff, uh, but I'm just gonna go raw dogging on this bitch. Mmm. Mmm. Mm-hmm. All right. Yeah. Mmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, man. That's good. Mm -hmm. I'd eat that sitting around watching the Office reruns on Netflix. All right. Can you guys see this? Let's get up there on them. Got the Chili Mac. Got the Chicken Creole. Kind of starts to. Boy, I chewed that. It wasn't until I really swallowed that I got just a little bit of a a kick. Oh, yeah? Of some spice. I had to swallow. I'm going to leave that one alone, ladies and gentlemen. Mickey Joe's first here on my channel. I pretty much left that wide open, you know. No, that's what she said. <laughs> I'm sorry. I couldn't fucking stop. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I also got a great uh, coronavirus joke. It's horrible, but do you want to hear it? Of course. 
I like my COVID like I like my women. 19 and easily spreadable. Oh, jeez. <laughs> You're right. That is pretty bad. Mmm. <laughs> that Chili Mac's good. Like, I can see why the troops love the Chili Mac. That's all right. Let me get in yeah. this, uh, kind of. Creole. Look at that. That looks nice. I do smell a little sort of like... God, what is that? Cayenne? Mmm. Hey, man. That's not bad. That Creole was not bad at all. What are you thinking on the Chili Mac? What are your thoughts? That's nice. It doesn't taste bad. And I understand, you know, it's a, yeah. it's a, uh, military meal. So the, uh, noodles just aren't going to be totally up to standard because they're, they're, but you know what, when mushy. you think about it, like they got a five year shelf life and they're good for far longer than that if well, you store them properly. So like, that's what I'm for saying. What they know? are, they're pretty great. I kind of wish this had a cold drink. Like I don't want to wash like hot food down with. Hot drinks. That's a breakfast thing for me. Mm -mm. That cocoa is good, though. Mmm. I'm going to get into this little piece of jerky. Okay. No. Like, I don't think. There you go. All you uh, YouTube fanners out there, that I have ever actually had Creole food before. Yeah. I don't know. Mm. As my husband will tell you, my memory is crap. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, newsflash, her memory is crap. Yeah. All right, I, that's not true. I have a your, bit of an issue. Your recall ability is crap. I always say that all those memories are in there. You just sometimes have trouble, like, opening that particular file cabinet. Yeah, everybody else is, Guys, this is, is running great. on like computer technology for their memory. Mine is all still shoved up in a really ugly, ugly like file cabinet. And it's like avocado green. Yes. From like 1973. All sorts of papers sticking out of it. Mm -hmm. That's about how organized I am. Mm. So, but I have to say, this tastes pretty good. It is, right? Yes. It's good. Yes. It's got big chunks of tomatoes. It's got... Peppers and onions. The chicken in here is nice. Uh, the rice is the right ratio, and yeah. it's perfectly cooked. It's yeah, it's that's good. Mm. I like this more mm. than I like that. That's good, you guys. Hmm. I like the jerky. It's a little. I mean, it's it's not really jerky. It's more like a flat piece of sausage stick, you know what I mean? It's chopped and formed. Um, if I had a like a nice knife and a chopping surface, I might chop that up, put it in there with a little of that cheese spread, or uh, just take one of these with the cheese spread and one of those mains and put it in there. I don't think I'm going to do that tonight. I don't think I need to burrito any of this stuff. I think it's all pretty good on its own. The Chili Mac would make a pretty nice burrito, I'm not going to lie. But I think this is pretty good on its own. It's got kind of a Chef Boyardee thing going on, which pretty much any tomato-based MRE item will sort of have that flavor. Mm. Some of them have been spiced and herbalized enough to step away from that for me because I am not a Chef Boyardee fan. Yeah. <clears throat> not unless she's heavily herbalized. You know what I mean? Yo, oh! no, no, no. Boy. Heavily, heavily herbalized at that point. So we got all three of these hot sauces, and we got the pack of crushed red pepper. Now, if you go back, way back, way back, way, way, way back to the beginning, like the... Oh, fuck, I dropped it. Like the second or third ration I ever did had this stuff in it, and I fucked it all up. Oh, it was the chicken pesto pasta. I put a little of this in there, and it just took it to a level that I was uh, not prepared for. This stuff is uh, pretty hot. Use it sparingly, y'all. Uh, this stuff is delicious. Yeah, that's a that's a nice little cocoa. Look at that spice cake. God damn. God damn. Mmm. 
Hmm. Hmm. That hits all the notes. That is exactly what you want out of... My main complaint, if, if it's even a complaint, is that it's a little, like... Crumbly is not the right word, but it's it's kind of dry, and it kind of just it almost dusts up in your mouth a little bit. The flavor, however, is tits, and I'm going to... God damn it. I shouldn't even put those there. I'm going to go in the coffee, and I'm going to do a little dippy dip like this. Oh, oh Lord. Mmm. Mmm. It is very tasty. Boo, 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 boo. That was delicious. Wow. What's your favorite thing going on here? Uh, you know, you're going to find it crazy. You like the Creole? I think it's the Creole. Wow. That's awesome. I've made Creole before. We were talking about this um, during the break. I am going to give this a shot. Um, the One of the restaurants that I worked at for a really long time had a lot of Cajun food on the menu. And so, but I couldn't quite remember. We had to look it up. Gumbo has the dark roux, and Creole has a light roux. Or, <clears throat> or perhaps it's uh, thickened with filet, which is kind of a Cajun thickener. It's that good. shit's good, though. This is this is good, you guys. I should have done this from the start. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. I don't know what else I can say about all of this. I'm a little disappointed there's not a cold drink. But, and man. Honestly, unless you're somebody that likes your mouth, like, on fire, you know. On fire! You know, there's not much point in having... You sauce. could if you wanted to. You could kick this all up a million notches, but I... I just I don't know, it's funny, good. like, I bought it because of the hot sauces, and, like, I don't, I'm not even going to use them. Oh, well. They just taste good. They so. do. These mains are good. The Creole is fantastic. I'm really surprised. I'm really surprised. Anyway, you guys, fucking stay <laughs> safe out there. Hey, hold on a second. We got to do these double sunset. You guys, stay safe out there for legit... Seriously, practice social distancing. Um, me and the missus aren't standing that far apart, so I feel sort of hypocritical. But like, well, I mean, this shit's legit. We live legit, in the same guys. place, so. Now this, it's not. It's not a big napkin. No, but not a it's big wet very. Uh, it is very wet. What she said. Hmm. It's. Yeah, it's kind of beachy smelling. It's nice. It's fresh. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's a good thing to do is sanitize your hands in times like these out there, folks. And also, always, forever, anyway. Um, yeah, I mean, but yeah. use your brain and always wash your hands. Don't just do it at a time like this. Yeah, don't just do it at a time like this. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys are all safe. We're safe. We're going to keep rocking and rolling as long as we can keep doing this. And, uh... We will see you next week, you guys. We love you. Thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe, all that shit. Have a great one. Have a great we'll one. We'll see you next time. We'll see you next time. Bye.